Al Gore has said the global warming bill will be the first step towards global governance. Former French President Jacques Chirac has said that Kyoto Protocol is the first step to an authentic global governance. What exactly do Al Gore and Jacques Chirac mean by global governance? Take the European Union, it started with just a very small bureaucracy. Just a few people designed to make sure there was enough coal and steel to go round after the end of the Second World War. That then became hideously transmogrified over the decades into the monster that it now is. There is, of course, a European Parliament for the sake of appearing democratic, but it can't propose legislation, it can't decide legislation, any decisions it does make can be overridden. Now that model is being taken by the UN as a shining example of what they wish to achieve at Copenhagen, where they are going to set up a world government. At first it will just appear to be a little technocratic committee, just like the European Union. They know how to do it. Start small so nobody quite notices, but make sure that it's, it's made by treaty so that all the countries who sign up to it are bound to it forever thereafter. That's the point about treaties. A treaty is the only way that foreigners can tell the US how far its constitution can go. It's the only way that the constitution itself, created by your founding fathers, can be subjugated by people overseas. And your president will go to Copenhagen, and if he can sign that treaty, he will. If he can't sign it, because he hasn't got two-thirds of the Senate to agree with him, what he will then do is to enact its provisions as a statute, because that only requires a simple majority of both houses.